Hi, welcome to the fifth part of the Spurgier housing in Katiwi 5. Today I want to do the fillets or rounds. And first I want to unite this solid here and that solid, that's body 1, yes, and body 5, yeah. And I want to remove that fillet here. So just select it and delete it. Now I want to join body 5 to body 1. I could reorder that tree, so let's go for maybe reorder children and sadly this little window opens in my second screen. And I want to move that body here below the geometrical set, so it's easier to see what happens. Now, let's go for Boolean operation, let's go for add. I want to add body 5 to body 1. And confirm. Then switch to the working object, the current body only visible. And then I could add a fillet of 5 mm on this edge here and on that edge. Yes, and confirm. Then I want to go for 10 mm on those edges here. So again, now I'll go for 10 mm on this edge, that one, this one, and that one. And confirm. Then I would have to correct my pocket here because I made the same small mistake in all my Spurgy housings and that would be body 5 which is now here below body 1 and it was a pocket, that pocket and that pocket is too deep. It should not be 7 but 6 millimeters. So let's change that and confirm. Great. Now let's go for a 5 millimeter fillet on this edge all around. So go for 5 millimeter and select this edge here. Seems it doesn't go all around, so I want to select this here as well. That looks good. Now go over here, select this edge or a corresponding one if possible this one and maybe that one and now it should go all around let's see yes this looks good great now here I need 1.5 millimeter let's see if this works here so maybe just collapse that and go again for the fillet and let's try 1.5 millimeter on this edge here and select that small part here as well maybe over here too yes and on the other side, of course, the same procedure. This edge, that small one, and this small one. I might change this to one millimeter. Let's take a look. Yes, looks pretty good. Great. Now, let's take a look at our other bodies. So, switch back to all of them okay I can make the fillets here beforehand or afterwards it doesn't really matter but I need this to be added to that solid here in order to do those here so maybe that's body 9 
Let's make it like that. And make this the work object. And then I could go for 5 millimeter on those four edges. Okay. And then add body 9 to body 1. This one. So make this the body which is in work. Then go for add and add body 9 to body 1 in this case. And confirm. Yes, looks good. And now I need those 0 0.7 millimeter fillets up here. So go for fillet, make it 0 0.7. And let's see, yeah, this edge here, that one, same on the other side, this one, and that one. Let's do it. Yes. And same fillet here and here. Confirm. Yep. And this edge all around and confirm. Now same on the other side. Zero point seven here, here, over there, and of course, come on. On this edge. Okay. And then on this one and on that one. Okay, and the last one up here. Great. That one should be three millimeter, so go for three millimeter. Select, it should go all around, yes, and confirm. Great. Okay, let's take a look at body let's make them all visible again and let's take a look at this body and that body so that's body seven make it the active body and let's add 10 millimeter fillets 10 millimeter let's go for this one here on this edge here Yes, and on the opposite side as well, like that, and confirm. Great. Now, let's check body 7. That's the one. Yes, I could do that one. So go for 10, no, 20 millimeters. On on this edge, that and this one, and that one, okay, and then add three millimeter on this edge and that edge, okay, great. So what's body three? That's body three, okay, and body eight, uh, yes, that one. Okay, add five millimeter on this edge, that one, this one, and of course that one. Confirm. And then 1.5 on this edge and that edge, and confirm. 
Great. Okay. Now it would be nice to combine those two, this one and that one. And that could save some time if I do just those two. So that's body 7 and body 8. So go for this one and add body 7 to body 8. And confirm like that. Yes, that's. I think that's a good idea because then I can do that 1.5 millimeter fillets on this edge. That one here. This one here. Turn it around. This edge. That one. And of course this one. And confirm. Great. And now let's add this one to body 1. So let's go for add this body here, that's body 8, to body 1. Up here, and confirm, yeah. And maybe, maybe, just maybe make that visible. So if I had a fillet here, yes, that's it. So switch back to just the active body. Let's go for 1.5 millimeter here. That should go all around. Yes. And same over there. And confirm. Great. Looks pretty good. Now let's bring in this one and add this one to that one. So that would be body 6 to body 1. Add body 6 to body 1 in this case. So that's this one. Confirm. Great. And now I should be able to do 5 millimeter on this edge. So go for 5 on this one here. Yeah. And on the other side. This one here. And confirm. Yes, that looks really nice. What's left to do? The cooling ribs. So let's go for the cooling ribs. That's body 3. Okay. Make just this one visible. And please note that's possible in CAD here, not in SOLIDWORKS, not in Siemens Nix, that you can have those separate solids in one body. Now I need one millimeter fillets on those pairs of edges here. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Let's see if we have edges and not faces. Oh, there's a one face. Let's remove that face. And another face. And another face. So maybe it's best to use the user selection filter. And then I got just the edges. That looks good. So let's confirm. Great. And now add body 3 to body 1. Maybe collapse those. Now go for another add and add body 3 to body 1. And confirm. Great. And now I need more one millimeter fillets on all those edges here. So 
one millimeter on this one, that one, this one, that one, this one, that one. Let's try to do them below as well. Okay, confirm. Looks okay, yep. Now switch over to this side and do the same. Go for fillet, this edge, that one, this one. Those, now those down below, maybe I could switch those values to 1.5, confirm, yes, that's okay. And I think I'm done for today. So I hope this was helpful. Hope you liked it. If you did like it, please give it a like or leave a comment. If you want to see more, please give it a like or leave a comment. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. That would really help. You could follow me also on GrabCat, LinkedIn, Instagram, X, and many more. Thanks for watching. See you to the next one. Bye-bye.